And now to our other top story, the first day of early voting here in the city. Fox 5's Lizette Nunez caught up with some New Yorkers headed to the polls about the issues most important to them. Early voting kicking off in New York City. New Yorkers casting their votes for mayor, public advocate, and comptroller. All five boroughs also voting for their next borough president, plus city council races in each district. Republican mayoral candidate and founder of the Garden Angels, Curtis Sliwa, casting his vote Saturday morning. I'm here uh, today to join in the early voting process, encourage uh, people to come out and vote. Meanwhile, his opponent, Democratic candidate and former NYPD Captain Eric Adams, stopping in Chinatown for a rally. Adams is the front runner in New York City's mayoral race as Democrats far outnumber Republicans in the city. Let's get out, let's vote, let's spend the next few days in the early voting process. And then November 2nd, something special happens. We take off the jerseys of different teams and we put on one jersey, Team New York. Team New York. Yeah. A polling location on the Lower East Side saw a steady flow of early voters. Voters sharing what issues are top of mind for them. Housing, for especially those who are uh, lower in income uh, people. Also those who are middle class, who both are probably working two or three, four jobs. Um, Second is health care. Climate change and the health and well-being of my community and hoping that they, you know, don't die of air pollution and drowning. I have the three kids, so I'm more is, uh, I need that my kids' education is to be better. Got sick and crying, that's, that's very important, especially with the youth. So we want someone in the office who is going to help us bring more services so we can provide more resources to the young people. And New Yorkers have until October 31st to cast their vote early. And a reminder just to make sure to check your polling location in advance because your early voting location might be different than your election day polling site. Lisa Nunez, Fox 5 News.